Hello friends, in this tutorial, how do you create a hard disk partition? How do you shrink a volume? You can see it's a D drive, it's a 465 GB. 275 GB is a free space, 330 GB is free space, 465 GB is E drive. If you want to make a, another drive, let's say F drive, G drive, and you want to have a different drive, and how do you shrink it? How do you create another partition from this existing uh, drive? So you can create a partition from a free space. So there is 275 GB free space. So you can create a partition from the free space. You have a 330 GB free space in my case in E drive. So I can create a partition from the free space 330 GB. So how do you do that? Let me show you. So we do it from here. So how do you get it here? Uh, you can see it's a this PC. So if you are using Windows 7 and all, you'll have a my computer. So give a right click on it, and then you're gonna click on this uh, manage. It's a manage. So click on manage, and then you'll have this computer management. In this, you're gonna see it's a disk management over here. It's a storage. If it is closed, you're gonna click on this drop down icon, and then here you have a disk management. So inside disk management, you have a number of drive over here. You can see bottom. So you can see here it is D drive. So my D drive uh, three is uh, it's a total six hundred four hundred sixty five GB. Even E drive is four hundred sixty five GB, GB. So some space are already occupied from free space. I can create partition whether from D or E. Let's say I want to create a partition from E. Give a right click on it. Once you give a right click on it, you just have to click on uh, shrink volume. You can see here is a shrink volume. So you just have to click on this shrink volume. It will take some time and you're going to see this. So once you see this, uh, if you want to create from D drive, give a right click on it and then click on shrink volume. So same procedure for both. So I'll be creating from E drive uh, and here it is. Now you can see uh, total space and here it is size of available shrink space so this much space is a free space that you can shrink and from that space how much uh, you want to shrink so here it is this uh, enter the amount you want to shrink so this is the total volume this is uh, the volume that is free right now that is available to shrink so out of this, how much you want to shrink, whether you want to shrink, how much it is available, almost all 33 GB, 338 GB, and it's around 330 GB. Or, or you just want to create a certain GB. So it is uh, written in MB. You can see it is written in MB. So 1024 MB is equals to 1 GB. So you can multiply with 1000 if you want to create a 5 GB free space. 5 GB another volume or 10 GB another volume. Let's say I want to create a 5 GB another volume. Okay, let's say if I want to create a 5 GB uh, total shrinkable space is this much and I want to create a 5 GB uh, another drive. I want to create a drive with a 5 GB. So I told you it is an MB. So multiply 5 into, mm, let me show you, it's uh, 5 into 1024. So 1024. So guys, I multiplied in a calculator 5 into 1024 and equals to. So total 5 into 1024 is equals to 5120. So we enter the same space over here 5120. 5120. So you can see out of this we have taken 5000. Uh, sorry guys, it's too much. It's a uh, out of this much we have taken 5120. 5120 out of this much. Now click on shrink. It will take some time. Okay, guys, you can see 5 GB unallocated. So, this is the way how you can shrink the volume, how you can create a partition from my existing partition. Uh, you can create another uh, uh, disk drive volume. And now, uh, you just have to check it out so when you check it out uh, 
you can see there are three you do not have the fourth one one that you have created the 5 GB one so what are you guys gonna do just uh, give a right click on it and here it is uh, let me show you properly you just have to give a right click on it and here it is uh, new simple volume over here click on new simple volume and you'll see this wizard click on next and then click on next and choose a letter which letter you want uh, you are from A to Z so I'll choose the letter F and click on next and whether you want NTFS or FAT32 so obviously if it is a computer you definitely need an NTFS uh, NTFS is for the desktop or the laptop so everything is fine so you can see everything should be default let it be as it is click on next and then click on finish and finally you can see it's a new drive F now it's all the way ready 5 GB and it's a healthy partition now so what you guys gonna do now you just gonna check it out whether it appeared over there now you can see guys here you have uh, it's a 4.99 GB 4.97 GB so out of 5 GB so it, this is the way how it gonna appear so now you have a new volume drive F so finally we have created a new partition from existing partition now you have a new drive and you can use it so guys if you like this tutorial be sure to hit the like button subscribe and comment i'll catch you in the next tutorial with another great stuff have a good day